All right, so here I am with the uh, evil, wicked, mean, and nasty black rifle. The assault rifle, I mean, I hope it didn't assault me while I'm trying to do this video of it. You know how people get agitated because you're filming them. So I'm going to let him hang out here, see what happens. You know, I'm going to, when I go to sleep tonight, I'll make sure I lock my bedroom door that I don't get assaulted. And, you know, weapons of war, yeah, I, we don't have a war going on right now, so I don't know what's going to happen. So we'll check sometime during the night. Well, I'll have to sneak out. I don't want him to know I'm coming out to check on him, but we'll see what happens in the morning if they're still here. I thought I heard something out in the living room where I left that scary black assault rifle, that weapon of war. I want to go check what it's up to. Make sure it's up, you know, it's there and not out and about up to no good. All right, I've snuck out in here to the living room and I'm gonna turn this light on. Look at there. I thought I heard something. I guess it was just my imagination. It's still right there where I put it. And it still has the two extra mags there. Nothing. What's going on? Well, it's been 24 hours. It hasn't moved. The magazine hasn't been put in. So I think I'm going to go ahead, put in the magazine, and I'm going to bring somebody out. And, you know, maybe they'll egg each other on, dare each other, and something's going to happen. All right, so now... I put that magazine in on the Bushmaster there. You know, I brought out a friend, you know, the Dasaba. So we're going to see if, like, they dare each other during the night. They go out and do some type of criminal acts or some vandalism and, you know, assaulting people or even shooting people. So we're going to see what happens, you know. We'll check back later. So here we are, the second night in a row. There's two of them. We're going to go check to see if they're up to something. If they've snuck out of the house. And, you know, if I don't see them, then, you know, I know they're up to no good. So let's go see what's happening. I can't believe it. They're both there. I mean, one's the AR-15, the scary black rifle. And I even put in an AR-15 platform. I mean, I'm sorry, AK-47 platform there. Got two extra mags. You know, you would think between the two of them, they'd want to be doing something out in the night, doing something bad, doing something wrong. They're not. They're just like just there all right here it is it's been like two days and both of them are still just sitting there i haven't seen them even move so i'm gonna get one more friend in there with them and i mean you know let's see what happens if there's three of them you know if they're gonna conspire together to do something and go out on a rampage so let me get another one in there all right so here we go you know, we're going on the third day, I added another one to them. You know, I don't know what's going to happen. There's three of them now. You know, may start, you know, starting a gang or something here. Well, we'll see what happens during the night. All right, so this is night number three. I'm going to see. I don't necessarily worry about trying to be quiet. I mean, because it's going to be hard for them to get back in the exact same position like they hadn't moved, you know, like they're faking it or something. So, look, again, let's go out and check on them. There they are. Just, you know, the three of them, you know, you would think they would be doing something. I mean, they haven't, they haven't even moved. Why is that? You know, you would think 
they would be out assaulting somebody or out roaming around and causing problems and doing things. They're just the way I left them. Even just the three of them, you think, you know, they would be egging each other on or daring each other to do something, but they're, they're just right there. All right, here we are, you know, after three days here, they're just still sitting here. I'm gonna add somebody else to this mix. I mean, it's gonna be like possibly a full car load, you know, cruising around looking for trouble, seeing what mischief they can get into. All right, so there we got the four of them together. So, I mean, you got like two of the AR-15 style platforms, two of the AK-47 platforms. I mean, what more can you ask for? I mean, you got two different things that are considered assault weapons that, you know, gosh, they're going to gang up on me tonight. I'm really going to have to lock my door. All right. You know, it's about, again, you know, I've tried different hours kind of sneaking out there to the living room, seeing if they've moved. So let's go out there, see if I can catch them being gone or moving about. Hopefully they're not right outside the door waiting to assault me. So let's go out. I'm going to be quiet. I don't hear anything, so let's go check. They're still there. You would think with the four of them, you know, they would be doing something. I mean, they're all like ready to go. Why haven't they moved? They're just like laying there. Why is that? Well, guys, I mean, I don't know what's happening. I got four of them sitting here. They haven't moved. I, I'm i going to add something else to the mix. You know, maybe, you know, like stir them up, something a little bit more concealable, rile them up, get their juices flowing or whatever. So we'll see what happens tonight. All right, got something a little bit more concealable. Maybe see if that gets them going there. That's the Tech 9. I mean, at one time, you know, they, they had that there that, you know, was bad too. I mean, it's all black. All right, so this is the fifth night in a row. We're gonna go out. I'm gonna see if I can't catch them doing something. If, you know, see if they're snuck out of the house. I can't believe it. They're all five still here. They ha they haven't even moved. Look. Still in the exact same place, exact position. Nothing. They're still there. All right, here we are on another day. I mean, I can't really believe they're just sitting there. I mean, you know, the Tech 9, you know, had kind of a bad reputation and everything. So I'll tell you what, I'm going to add one more thing to this mix and just, you know, see if I can't get something out of them. You know, some type of reaction, some type of belligerence or something. So we'll see what happens when I add the next one. All right, here we go. I've added one more pistol to the mix here. This is the Masterpiece Arms. I mean... You got the 7.62 by 39s, the same, you know, the 5.56. You got the nine millimeters here. I mean, I, I guess we'll see what happens tonight. All right, you know, it's about 2 a.m. And I'm gonna go out there and see if they're still there or what's going on with them. There's, you know, the two AKs, the two, you know, the AR-15s, the two pistols. I want to see if I can catch them being out and about.
you know, this is like, what, the sixth night in a row? They're still there. You would think, you know, at 2 a.m. they'd be out cruising, causing trouble, breaking in, doing things, you know, illegal. They're not. I can't believe that. All right. I cannot believe it. You've got six of the scary assault weapons here. I didn't get assaulted during the night. I don't, they haven't moved. You know, I've checked on them every night and they're still where they are. You know, like I said, you know, we got the Bushmaster here. You know, we got the Zatava. You know, I got my build for the Arrow 15. I got a Mahdi AK. I got the Tech 9, and we got the Masterpiece Arms. I I just don't understand how these got the bad reputation of assault weapons, because they haven't moved. They they didn't even get up and assault me during the night, even even all together. They didn't gang up on me and do anything. So I, I, you guys, tell me what's your opinion about this.